China is home to some of the world's most impressive feats of engineering, but few projects are as ambitious or as controversial as the $34 billion Three Gorges Dam. Built to tame the mighty Yangtze River, this colossal structure is the largest hydroelectric dam in the world. The idea for the Three Gorges Dam was conceived as early as the 1910s, but it wasn't until 1994 that construction began. The Chinese government had a bold vision to generate clean energy, control devastating floods along the Yangtze, and create a symbol of the country's growing global influence. By the time it was completed in 2012, the dam stood at 185 meters high and stretched over 2.3 kilometers across, with the capacity to generate a staggering 22,500 megawatts of electricity, enough to power tens of millions of homes. However, building the dam came at a monumental cost, not just financially, but socially and environmentally. Over 1.4 million people were displaced as entire towns and villages were submerged. Ancient cultural sites were lost forever, and environmentalists warned of irreparable damage to the Yangtze River ecosystem. The project's $34 billion price tag doesn't even account for the long-term costs of managing these consequences. On one hand, the Three Gorges Dam has been a triumph for China. It provides about 3% of the country's electricity, replacing millions of tons of coal use and reducing greenhouse gas emissions. It also offers critical flood control for the Yangtze River Basin, potentially saving thousands of lives. But critics argue that the dam's benefits are outweighed by its challenges. Silt buildup threatens its long-term operation, and recent flooding events have raised questions about its effectiveness. So, was China's $34 billion dam worth it? The Three Gorges Dam is undeniably a technological marvel, but its legacy is a complicated one, highlighting both the power and peril of human ambition. What do you think? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell for more stories. See you in the next one.